I'll go back. So I bought the mystery key. And I'm pretty sure it's for the house that's up here. It's locked. Use. You used the mystery key. The red house's door was unlocked. The key disappeared. Oh, well, okay. Oh, there's lots of books. Um, have a look. Dear Diary, Shiren's sister fell down recently. It's sad. Without her sister to speak to her, she's become more reclusive than ever. So I reached out to her and told her that she, Blue Key and I, should all perform together sometime. She seemed to like that idea. I think by fell down, they mean she died. Dear Diary, I like to buy a new diary for every time I have every entry I make. I love to collect diaries. Dearest Diary, our cousin left the farm to become a training dummy. That leaves just Blukey and I. Blukey asked me if I was going to try and become Corporal too. They sounded so... resigned. Come on, Blukey. You know I'd never leave you behind. And besides, I'd never find the kind of body I'm looking for anyway. My darling diary, I met someone interesting today. Last week I posted that advertisement for my human fan club. Today was our first meeting. Only one other person came. Honestly, she's a dork, and she's obsessed with these awful cartoons. But she's kind of funny too. I want to see her again. Diary, my dear. My diary collection is going fabulously. I have like five now. Dear diary, she surprised me with something today. Sketches of a body she wants to create for me. A form beyond my wildest fantasies. In a form like that, I could finally feel like myself. After all, there's no way I can become a star the way I am now. Sorry, Blukey. My dreams can't wait for anyone. So, I'm guessing Metaton was a ghost that was put into that body, and Blukey was his brother or cousin or something. And that training dummy was one too. And that's why Blukey called him up at the end of that fight. So there you go, now we all know about that. There was one more thing I want to do. So, just meet me there, okay? That's right everyone, I'm going to send Tebby to college, because I got lots of money, so let's uh, send to college. Ten pay for colleague. Yeah, yeah. Whoa, that's a lot of money, can Tem really accept? Okay, so Tem go to colleague and make you proud. You forgot your face. And there's wiggly lines in the back for a tea. Tem back from Cool Egg. Tem learned many things. Learn to sell new item. Yeah. -ah. And then I'm going to buy. Oh, that's really expensive. Can't afford it. Bugger. Well, I was going to buy the Temi armor, but I'm guessing I'm going to have to go without it. Oh well. Now I could grind for some more money, but I kind of want to uh, finish this, so just uh, we'll go visit the king now, shall we? So I'll see you there as well. Okay, so this is where I last left us off, so now we can finally continue. Maybe finish this, who knows. Boop, 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 walking down, oh god. Pretty sure that's not the king. That looks like Sans. So you finally made it. The end of your journey is at hand. In a few moments, you will meet the king. Together, you will determine the future of this world. That's then. Now, you will be judged. You will be judged for your every action. You will be judged for every EXP you've earned. What's EXP? It's an acronym. It stands for Execution Points. A way of quantifying the pain you have inflicted on others. When you kill someone, your EXP increases. When you have enough EXP, your love increases. Love, too, is an acronym. It stands for Level of Violence. A way of measuring someone's capacity to hurt. The more you kill, the easier it becomes to distance yourself. The more you distance yourself, the less you will hurt. The more easy you can bring yourself to hurt others. But you, you never gained any love. Of course, that doesn't mean you're completely innocent or naive, just that you kept a certain tenderness in your heart. 
no matter what, no matter the struggles or hardships you faced, you strive to do the right thing. You refuse to hurt anyone. Even when you ran away, you did it with a smile. You never gain love, but you gain love. Does that make sense? Maybe not. Now, you're about to face the greatest challenge of your entire journey. Your actions here will determine the fate of the entire world. If you refuse to fight, Asgore will take your soul and destroy humanity. But if you kill Asgore and go home, monsters will remain trapped underground. What will you do? Well, if I were you, I would have thrown in the towel by now. But you didn't get this far by giving up, did you? That's right. You have something called determination. So as long as you hold on, so as long as you do what's in your heart, I believe you can do the right thing. Alright. We're all counting on you, kid. Good luck. Where's he gone? He's a spooky one, that skeleton. Five spooky, eight me. Phone room. I'm not even, it's not even saying failed with determination anymore. It's down here. I don't want to go in the phone room yet, there's more to see. Try and show off as much as I can. There's probably a few things I've missed, but... Well, you, you just don't have your time for it. Uh-oh. It's a coffin. There's a name engraved in it. Marin. It's empty. Oh, that's my coffin. Let's do this. Oh god, there's flowers. Please don't tell me flowers here. <laughs> Dum de dum. Oh, is someone there? Just a moment. I have almost finished watering these flowers. Here we are. Howdy. How can I? Shit, son. You scared of me? Oh. Go on. I say badly want to say, would you like a cup of tea? But, you know how it is. Yeah, you're a murderer. That's how it is. I ain't killed no one. Nice day today, huh? Birds are singing. Flowers are blooming. Perfect weather for a game of catch. You know what we must do? When you are ready, come into the next room. Stranger danger! Stranger danger! Right, oh, take a seat, sit down. Oh, hang on, what's this? It's another phone cover by a white sheet. It's got a face on it. It's got like a little smiley face. I want to be king. I want to be king of monsters. How tense! Just think of it like... A visit to the dentist. This this doesn't seem right. Is this going to hurt? Are you ready? If you are not, I understand. I am not ready either. The end. So we are at the end. Dude, this is well, it looks well aced. I don't know if I'm ready for this, honestly. This is the barrier. This is what keeps us all trapped underground. If, if by chance, you have any unfinished business, please, do what you must. Ah, oh, I'm good, let's continue. Alright, I see. This is it, then. Ready? Uh, you're not taking my soul. Alright, I'm not having this shit. Strange light fills the room. Twilight is shining through the barrier. It seems your journey is finally over. You're filled with determination. Human. It was nice to meet you. Goodbye.
Dude, what the fuck? What am I supposed to do? I can't spare you! What the hell? Um, let's talk. You quietly tell Asgore you don't want to fight him. His hands tremble for a moment. Oh, no. That's not trembling. Jesus. Um, I'm pretty sure I might have to fight this guy, because Sam literally did say I have to fight him. You tell Asgore you don't want to fight him. His breathing gets funny for a moment. Oh no, say that. Oh, yep, yeah, that's fine. Uh, uh, talk. You firmly tell Asgore to stop fighting. Recollection flashes in his eyes. Asgore's attack dropped. Asgore's defense dropped. He's doing like a tutorial where he doesn't want to attack me. Oh no! Oh shit, I need to heal already. Yeah. If you're going to telegraph your moves, you need to do like an attack. Seems talking won't do any more good. Alright, I guess I'm fighting you then. Dodge this shit! Right. Um. Oh, that's weird. I haven't actually attacked anyone yet. Dude, this moves is well ace. I really like it. Trying to look like I know what I'm doing. Boop, 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 boop. Right. Move, start, move. See, that's pretty, like, easy to dodge. Well, for now, to, like, mess it up later. Oh, God. I wasn't even paying attention. I need to heal again. Jesus. Oh, yeah, I bought loads of junk food as well. Because I couldn't buy the armor, so I was like, bag it! So I just bought it. And that's not too bad to dodge. Just move around. Move around! Move around! Move around! Oh god. Oh god. Yeah, that's, I'm not very good at that. It's kind of odd when you don't have to attack the whole game. This is so weird, actually, like, fighting someone. I'm trying to kill them. I'm hoping it, it's kind of like, at the end, it gives me a chance to, like, not fight him, or maybe he stops. I hope he stops. I don't want to kill anyone. I've got this far without killing anyone. I sure hope I'm doing the right thing. I don't want to mess this up right at the end. Sparky, Sparky! Shit! Got me with the orange one at the end. Mm. Alright, we're halfway there. Halfway there. It's got a... Oh shit! Now! It's got intense fast, didn't it? I don't like this one because it's kind of like everywhere. I don't. I kind of want to heal because I have a feeling I could die like straight away. Or I could just get good. Oh, jeez, that's way too fast. No, 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 no. I need to heal. Shit, now. Oh yeah, I went and got another snowman piece by the way as well. So I don't fucking know what it does. I really hope I don't die against this guy. Your ass is grass and I'm gonna mow it. I should have kept that armor on that heals me. I'm such a silly Billy. Don't do the fast one. Don't do the fast one. What did I say? I said don't. Oh god. I'm running out of food! See that? That was flawless. Flawless Raider right there. 
Uh, do more and more damage with each attack, so... This last one could do it! <gasps> He's still alive though! So that is how it is. I remember the day after my son died. The entire underground was devoid of hope. The future had once again been taken from us by the humans. In a fit of anger, I declared war. I said that I would destroy any human that came here. I would use their souls to become godlike and free us from this terrible prison. Then I would destroy humanity and let monsters rule the surface in peace. Soon the people's hopes returned. My wife, however, became disgusted with my actions. She left this place, never to be seen again. Truthfully, I do not want power. I do not want to hurt anyone. I just wanted everyone to have hope. But, I cannot take this any longer. I just want to see my wife. I'm guessing your wife's Toriel. Because she's the only other like, goat person I've seen. Or cow person. And he did have another throne in that place. So I'm guessing it's her. Because it would make sense. She wanted a kid as well. I just want to see my child. Please, young one. This war has gone on long enough. You have the power. Take my soul and leave this cursed place. Oh, I can still spare him. I'm going to spare you. Because I'm a good boy. Barry Smythe, he's a good boy. After everything I've done to hurt you, you'd rather stay down here and suffer than live happily on the surface. Yeah, the surface sucks. Mate, and I'm friends with Papyrus. Like, can you blame me? Human. I promise you. For as long as you remain here, my wife and I will take care of you as best we can. We can sit in the living room, telling stories, eating butterscotch pie. We could be like, like a family. What the hell? Oh, for fuck's sake. Ah, oh, I wonder who that was. I wonder who does that attack like all the time. This fucking prick. You killed him. Why would you kill him after I saved him? So annoying. You idiot. You haven't learned a thing. In this world, it's kill or be killed. Shit, it's absorbing the souls. 